Russia is losing Crimean hub in Black Sea, Ukrainian Navy chief. Ukraine's Navy chief, Vice Admiral Alexei Nispapa, said that Russia's Black Sea fleet has been forced to relocate most of its combat-ready warships from occupied Crimea due to Ukrainian attacks. Euractiv reports, citing Nispapa, that missile and naval drone strikes have severely damaged the Sevastopol base, a crucial logistics center for the Russian Navy. They were established over many decades, possibly centuries, and clearly they are now losing this hub, he said. The vice admiral claimed that Ukraine has destroyed or damaged 27 Russian naval vessels, including five damaged by sea mines laid by Ukrainian naval drones near Sevastopol Bay. He said that Russia has moved its ships to Novorossiysk and the Sea of Azov, but these locations lack the extensive facilities of Sevastopol. Almost all the main combat-ready ships have been moved by the Russian forces from the main base of the Black Sea fleet and the ships are kept in Novorossiysk and some of them are kept in the Sea of Azov, Nispapa said. The relocation has impacted Russia's ability to launch cruise missile strikes on Ukraine as Sevastopol served as the primary storage and loading site for these weapons. Nispapa suggested that Russia is now trying to solve this logistical problem in Novorossiysk. Ukraine's success in the Black Sea has allowed it to establish its own shipping corridor without Russian approval. Nice Papa said that Russian warships no longer enter a northwestern area of the Black Sea, covering almost 25,000 square kilometers. The Vice Admiral expressed optimism about the future delivery of F-16 fighter jets, stating they would help challenge Russia's air dominance over the Black Sea. F-16s with the right armaments will be able to push away Russian warplanes. The northwestern part of the Black Sea, particularly the corridor for civilian ships, will be almost 100% secure, he said. Nice Papa also discussed Ukraine's desire to expand its shipping corridor to include the ports of Mykolaiv and Kherson, but said this is currently impossible due to Russia's control of the Kinburn spit. Moscow seized and annexed Crimea from Ukraine in 2014. Before February 2022, Russia used its Black Sea Fleet, which consists of dozens of warships, to project power into the Mediterranean and the Middle East. The image of Russia's rockets fired from the Caspian Sea into Ukraine on July 8 has been released. Insider Telegram channel shared a video in this regard. It was surprising that the rockets flew too low and passed right by the fishing boats. Russia periodically launches missile strikes on objects in Ukraine from the territory of the Caspian Sea. Technically, since Russia launches long-range cruise missiles with a declared flight range of up to 5,000 kilometers, the place of the actual launch has no practical significance. Missiles from the Caspian Sea can reach Kharkiv, Dnipro, Vinnytsia, Lviv, Kiev or Odessa with equal success. Therefore, most likely, the launches happen in the regions that have available volumes of missiles, which are then being sent to one or another strategic object in Ukraine, or when there is information about a corridor potentially free from Ukrainian anti-aircraft defenses and radars not because it is more convenient to hit a specific point from there. It is quite likely that there is also a geopolitical reason for the Russians to use the Caspian Sea's airspace and water area to attack Ukraine. This is a demonstration of their actual military dominance to the neighboring states in the region. So far, Russia's Caspian neighbors, Kazakhstan, Iran, Azerbaijan and Turkmenistan, have no obvious conflicts with the Russians. Hey, I love what I'm going to do.